USB-C versus USB-A. What you need to know, USB or Universal Serial Bus is a standard that defines the connectors, cables, and protocols used for connecting and transferring data and power between devices. USB has evolved over the years, and there are now different types of USB connectors and cables that offer different capabilities and compatibility. In this article, we'll compare two of the most common USB types, USB-C and USB-A. So what is USB-C? USB-C is the latest generation of USB connectors, which was introduced in 2014. It has a small, thin, and oval-shaped design that's reversible, meaning you can plug it in either way without worrying about the orientation. USB-C is also capable of delivering more power and faster data transfer speeds than previous USB types. USB-C isn't just a connector, but also a standard that supports various protocols and features. For example, USB-C can support USB power delivery, which allows for charging devices up to 100 watts, such as laptops, tablets, and phones. USB 3.0 and higher, which enable data transfer speeds up to 20 Gbps with USB 3.2 Gen 2x2, Thunderbolt 3 and 4, which are high-speed protocols that can deliver up to 40 Gbps of data transfer and support multiple displays and peripherals, DisplayPort, HDMI, and other video output standards, which allow for connecting monitors and TVs with a single cable, audio accessories such as headphones and speakers. USB-C is becoming the standard port for many modern devices, such as smartphones, laptops, tablets, and gaming consoles. However, not all USB-C ports and cables are the same. Depending on the device and the cable, they may support different protocols and features. Therefore, it's important to check the specifications of your device and cable before using them. Now, what is USB-A? USB-A is the most common and familiar type of USB connector that's been around since 1996. It's got a flat and rectangular shape that fits into a horizontal port. Unlike USB-C, USB-A is not reversible, so you have to insert it the right way. USB-A is mainly used for connected peripherals and accessories such as keyboards, mice, flash drives, printers, scanners, cameras, etc. However, USB-A can also support data transfer and charging functions with compatible devices and cables. USB-A can support various versions of USB standards, such as USB 1.0 and 1.1, which offer data transfer speeds up to 12 Mbps, USB 2.0, which offers data transfer speeds up to 480 Mbps, USB 3.0 and higher, which offer data transfer speeds up to 10 Gbps with USB 3.1 Gen 2. However, unlike USB-C, USB-A can support other protocols and features, such as Thunderbolt or DisplayPort. Therefore, you may need additional adapters or cables to connect your devices to other types of ports and devices. How to choose between USB-C and USB-A? The choice between USB-C and USB-A depends on your device and your needs. Here are some factors to consider. Compatibility. If your device has a USB USB-C port, you can use a USB-C cable connected to other devices that have a USB-C port or a compatible adapter. However, if your device has a USB-A port or an older version of a USB port, such as micro USB or mini USB, you may need a different cable or adapter to connect it to a device with a USB-C port. Functionality If you want to use your device for high-speed data transfer or charging functions, such as power delivery, you may need a USB-C cable that supports these features. However, if you only want to use your device for basic functions such as connecting peripherals or accessories, you may be fine with a standard USB-A cable. Convenience If you want to use one cable for multiple purposes, such as connecting displays or audio devices, you may prefer a USB-C cable that supports various protocols and features. However, if you have multiple devices with different types of ports, such as HDMI or audio jack, you may need multiple adapters or cables to use them with a single USB-C cable.